All right, gamers, listen up. We're about to dive deep into the settings and unleash the full potential of your computer for maximum performance in Rust. Get ready for smoother gameplay and higher frame rates. It's time to leave that lag behind. Let's go. First up, we're disabling full screen optimization. This forces the game to run using the traditional full screen mode, and this can prevent conflicts with window management and can provide a more stable experience. Next, we are going to tweak high DPI scaling override. Setting it to application, this ensures the game renders at the correct size and doesn't cause blurry visuals. Then, let's optimize for windowed games by turning this setting on. This setting allows for some rendering features to be used and can lead to improved performance when playing windowed games or borderless windowed games. Now we need to enable hardware accelerated GPU scheduling. This allows the GPU to directly manage its own resources, which can reduce latency and increase performance, especially for newer GPUs. Next, we will customize virtual memory settings. By setting a custom size, make sure the initial size and the maximum size is set to the same value. This ensures that the operating system has sufficient space to use as virtual RAM if needed and can prevent stuttering. Time to change power plan to high performance, which makes sure that your computer is utilizing all the performance, however using more energy. Lastly, we are using adjust image settings with preview and choosing use my preference emphasizing performance, and this will prioritize performance over visual quality. Last but not least, let's turn on game mode. This makes sure that Windows prioritizes your game for the best performance. These are the best settings you should be using for maximum performance. Okay, so you're looking to boost your FPS, right? Well, you've come to the right place because I've got something that's going to blow your mind. I've personally crafted and tested a script that's a game changer for Windows 10 and 11. We're talking smoother gameplay, faster response times, and an overall optimized system, it is like overclocking your brain for gaming. Don't worry, this isn't some shady hack. I made sure that every change is reversible. So you can go back to the way things were if you change your mind. I will guide you step by step so you can expect to see significant improvements in your favorite games with less lag, more frames, and a much more consistent experience overall. Okay. Let's dive right into optimizing this computer. First up, we're creating a system restore point. This is like a safety net. 
allowing us to revert back to this point if anything goes wrong, it will help you to restore your computer to the state it was before we began, if any issues arise. Next, we're opening Auto Runs. This program shows you everything that starts up automatically with your computer. We can disable unnecessary programs here which can improve boot times and free up system resources. All right, now let's head over to Apps and Features where we can see all of the installed apps on the system. Here, we can uninstall programs that we don't need or use. Removing these unused programs helps to free up storage space and can improve overall system performance. Now we're on to the NVIDIA Profile Inspector. Here we can fine-tune your graphics card settings for specific applications and games, pushing your visual experience to the max. These are the best settings to boost performance and visual fidelity. Next up, we're gonna run our Remove All Bloatware script. This powerful tool removes all of the unnecessary pre-installed software leaving the computer cleaner, more efficient, and faster. Finally, we have our optimizer software. Here you can see many options, including disabling unnecessary features. The benefits of this is to improve performance, reduce lag, and make your system faster. Thank you. 